So while it's been four years since either the Vampire Diaries alum, Ian Summerholder, who's now 44, or his Twilight actress spouse, Nikki Reed, 35, has sunken their teeth into a new role. They've been busy digging into a different type of passion. We are farm people is what he told E! News, that he loves his country, rural type lifestyle where he grows his own vegetables and he grows everything on his land. And him and his wife do look very healthy, don't they? They look extremely lean and healthy. Like they he said he stepped away from acting because he wanted to raise his kids and build um, his companies and get different films launched. So he's been busy and it looks like the country lifestyle is good. He talks about his motivation and his commitment to environmentalism and he's from Louisiana and he felt like an increased responsibility to address climate change after becoming a father in 2017. Now, you guys know both of them. Um, they're both actors, so you know they both made enough money, I would say, to have this type of lifestyle. But one of the things I do want to point out, I know people get turned off by the word climate change and all that, but I do like the fact that he's thinking about his children and long term. He says that he recognizes the importance of soil management and decided to team up with a uh, filmmaker, Josh and Rebecca Tickle, on this documentary called Common Ground. If you see there, it has quite a few notab notable characters in here. I mean, I I've never heard of it. If you list like much to do about nothing, unless the big countries get on board with really um, reducing their carbon footprint and celebrities especially like him and Nikki Reed who they look like they live a lifestyle of travel and fun and you know um all of this stuff unless people cut back on all their jet setting and all that stuff um we're gonna just be right back at square one good for you guys though that you know you guys get to live a sustainable life and have acres of farmland and you can live a good life that's that's great I mean I think this would be the ideal if you ask me the ideal way of living this would be it you know you grow your own crops you live a, a lifestyle of um, clean eating and healthy diet and less stress you know they don't look like they're stressed out at all um, they live with their two kids and 18 pets and they describe the joys of farm life um, tending to crops and caring for various animals which is like a dream come true right just hanging out with animals um, on their exp expansive um, property so it says despite the challenges in the article that I'm reading from and I'm just laughing because like what challenges is he having this looks like a pretty damn good lifestyle if you ask me um, he finds the experience truly special appreciating the harm harm harmonious existence um coexistence of diverse life forms on the farm yeah so what do you guys think of this this is where ian summerholder has been hiding out in case you guys are curious i think it's beautiful i think it's wonderful i only pray and hope this for all of you i hope that we can get back to a point where we start really taking care of the land do you guys see this happening for the future for the rest of us or just for celebrities i mean i do appreciate that he has this this documentary whatever you want to call it movie i mean i think it's good that he's bringing attention to the fact that we have like soil depletion we have issues with our environment but i see people still outside spraying our skies with chemicals and monsanto um, forcibly for forcing farmers to buy from them and we know that their seeds are gmo'd saving the planet one acre at a time we see that Bill Bill uh, Gates owns tons of farmland. You guys really, you guys tell me in the comments. <laughs> Anyways, have a great day and remember to think for yourself.